Hi y'all and a welcome back to It's Andrea Michelle Sis and yes I am back. Look let me go over here really really fast and cut this TV down because your girl can't concentrate and I know that y'all look I know that y'all want to see what I got from Target's because yes I went to Target's today I just you know it's it's look I've been shopping Christmas shopping all that stuff y'all and I see y'all on here posting all y'all stuff and girls like bruh like <laughs> okay let me start posting myself too I just been chilling y'all I've been in my a I just y'all I just been chilling watching y'all loving y'all videos and stuff like that and um, you know catching up because like I, I used to film a lot you guys like content content um, and consistent so you know what I say you know what I'm, I'm watching y'all just showing all this stuff from targets and Marshalls Ross all Yes, sis. I, I watch y'all, okay? And um, so, yeah, I uh, decided let me go ahead and make a haul because I haven't made a haul with you guys in a, a minute, okay? And so I'm ready to share everything. I'm ready to get back, you know, consistent on YouTube and start up, you know, um, in November and in December. Uh, some more content for you guys so um it's gonna be a little change but it's just a little hiccup okay so let's get into the haul so i want to tell you guys about this amazing targets bag you guys when i tell you i love targets recycle reuse bags like i use them all the time i have so many of these like even my boyfriend when he comes on he's just like babe why you got so many recycle reuse bags i said babe you just don't know like i'm gonna tell y'all a secret whenever y'all purchase recycle reuse bags from targets do believe you do save 10% off on your purchase as long as it has this little, you know, this little Target's logo on it. Um, you do get 10% off on your purchase. Now, I don't know about all Target's, but I do know about the Target's that I go to and I've been saving y'all. So let me just get into this haul really quick because look, sis ain't trying to hold y'all. So I got some good stuff um, from Target's you guys and um, I just want to share with you guys what I'm going to come up with um, for dinner tomorrow um, and not tonight. <laughs> And I just bought some, you know, some extra stuff just to be, you know, having on hand, some pantry items and stuff like that. But I'm going to tell y'all, you guys, don't be afraid to go to Target because Target has amazing prices. And if you buy their brand of, um, their brand of food, like the Up and Up or the Good and Gather, you definitely are going to save some money. Make sure you download that Cartwheel app. From targets because you do save money and you do get money back um, and I think I've showed you guys on for instance on another haul that I did I think it was a while back where I saved up some coins sis like but I recently used it on a Christmas gift so I'm back down to like 205 2005 cents girl like <laughs> Okay, but you know your girl about to get it back up because I stay in Target. That's like my second home, okay, besides mom's. But anyways, let's get into it. I got some Black Label Applewood Bacon. This is like a fave. I don't eat this all the time, but when I am craving some bacon, like, yes. Instead of my turkey, my usual turkey bacon, when I'm craving like some, bread, you know, bacon, bacon, I can't keep this in my house because... My boyfriend, he comes over, and my son loves this bacon, and so, yeah, it, it won't last. <laughs> and then I got some chicken, you guys. I got the Good and Gather, that's which is Target's brand, and this is just boneless chicken breast. I got this for $7.48, and these are huge chicken breasts. You can definitely cut these in half and have them for at least three meals. Like, seriously, sis, you can have this for three meals. And let me just come up with three meals for you. Like, I am going to do Hawaiian um, pulled chicken 
um, rolls, um, little sandwiches. Um, so that's what I'm gonna do. You can have like chicken spaghetti, or you can have like a chicken enchilada. I mean, these are a uh, big chicken breast, so you like I said, you can cut them down, or you can put them in put the, uh, some of it in salad. However you like it, do it. Okay. I did get some. Um, some pantry staples that I needed um, I still have some but I want to keep it up like you know um, just in case like girl <laughs> you know uh, sis ain't uh, gonna want to get out to go to the store so I'll just have some on hand I did get some uh, crushed red pepper I got some more um, garlic powder I love like love 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 garlic powder in almost everything <laughs> Um, and then I got some sweet baby rays, uh, honey barbecue sauce. It's so good. I'm trying to find the one. It's Hawaiian barbecue, I think. It's Hawaiian brown sugar barbecue. I am like on the hunt for it. I can't find it in the store. So my next best thing, I'll probably go to Amazon and see if they have it there. Um, I did get some organic ketchup. I got two of these. One back there and then this one. And then I got some... Uh, Helmets. I didn't know that they sell the light helmets, so I went ahead and got that because I'm going to be making with our little Hawaiian sandwiches, chicken sandwiches. We're going to have a potato salad, so I definitely want to put it in there. Um, and then I got some. If you guys ever tried these Stone Fire um, mini nan garlic breads, let me know in the comments below because this is my first time ever trying nan. And I see a lot of people making like little pizzas and making little, you know, little sandwiches out of them. And yes, y'all, my nails are just jacked up, just pretty much jacked up. This one right here, that's why my finger like this because my finger, this thing is, my finger is swollen because this is broken to my nail and it hurts so bad. But no matter what, we're going to get through it, okay? We're going to get through this this vlog here this haul and uh, yes so it says like it says perfect for a toaster the toaster so me personally I don't like toaster so I'll probably just put it in like the oven and let it get all good okay let's go to the next thing <laughs> I did get some king Hawaiian rolls for our pulled uh, chicken sandwiches that we're gonna have and then I got some bush baked beans because I am going to make these but I'm gonna make them homemade um i'm gonna wrap the them and put them in the oven with a little bacon on top and yes that's what we do <laughs> so i got some brown sugar hickory bush beans um and i didn't have the vegetarian ones that i honestly love but it's okay i did get some mozzarella and provolone cheese this is like my all-time only favorite cheese that i love to eat on my salads and stuff like that but we're gonna speak a little bit of this on our pulled chicken sandwiches um then also i got some keeler sundaes shortbread pecan um cookies these are like a staple and they don't last i am serious they don't last they will not last a week in this house so i got some more of these i normally try to get like the little family pack but they didn't have it then i got some briars uh, butter pecan um, ice cream and this is something new that I'm trying we've tried the vanilla chocolate and strawberry so now we're gonna try just the butter pecan one um, I'm sure it'll be good I did get some simply lemonade um, and I can't wait to try it this is in the raspberry lemonade so I got that one I did try the strawberry lemonade one and it is also good it is so good so if you see that at Target's or anywhere you pick it up because it's really really good um, and then I got just a little thing of Oak Farms 2% reduced fat milk um, and then I got some the family size cinnamon toast crunch churros you guys, when I first had these, these were so freaking good. Like, I would choose these over the Cinnamon Toast Crunch. That's how bad, like, that's how, not bad, but that's how good these are. So, they are a little high in calorie, but sis, on those days when we are PMSing and Mother Nature decides to show her face, 
yeah these are what I go to instead of like chocolate and stuff like that so I eat these dry um, and then sometimes I, I eat them with the uh, almond milk and stuff like that um, I did get like one little red onion I know they had like a recall on onions or something like that but um, the other day I bought one and I was like you know what I love my onion like I'm gonna go ahead and try it see what's going on I didn't get sick nobody got sick we were good so I went ahead and got another one um, and then I got some of the russet potatoes um, these are just the, the brown ones um, so yeah you guys that is it for this haul yes this haul but I do have a all these haul that is coming up next so stick around so you can see what I got all the good finds all the new finds um yeah so let me get that together and get all this stuff where it needs to go and then I'll be right back with the all these haul so here we are with the lovely all these haul you guys it's going to be super small super quick um that's if I don't start rambling to y'all <laughs> But I love, 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 love all these recycle, reuse bags. Definitely keep them, hold on to them. Um, because, girl, like, every time you go in that store, you have to buy a bag. Like, keep your bags that you buy so you won't have to buy another bag. Or get you some other bag. Like, sometimes I do take my Target's bag into all these. Like, I do. But if you are on a budget or something like that like sis bruh keep your bags hold on to them like don't trash them don't put them in your trash little trash can in the bathroom hold on to them because nine times out of ten you're gonna be making another all this trip okay so and i know no nobody want to keep buying all these bags when you have to put the 25 cents in the cart and i know that you sometimes get the 25 cents back because when i say sometimes like where I shop at my Audis, where on my location in Texas, um, they don't give you the card bag. So you're just paying 25 cents and you're not getting your 25 cents bag like they promised. Um, but they sometimes the all these people do keep the cart so you are not able to get your 25 cents back. Um, and then on top of that, you have to buy the bags uh, because if you don't have a bag and you don't have extra boxes, then you gotta hold your stuff and nobody got time for that, okay? <laughs> so yes, sis and bruh, make sure you keep and hold on to your all these bags at all times. <laughs> fold them up, put them in a the drawer or fold them up and keep them in your car. However, whatever you gotta do, do it, okay? <laughs> save us, save, save some money, okay? Um, so I bought these steaks. These are um, just steaks for um, marinating, and uh, we're gonna probably put these on the grill and have like either steak tacos or we're gonna just have steaks and um, baked potato um, and some corn. Um, so yeah, I got this steak, and it was like ten fifty four. At Aldi's, you can find you some steak a little bit cheaper than that. Um, but at my Aldi's, they always try to keep the meat hot. I don't know why, um, but I've heard that you can go to different Aldi's and find meat cheaper. But I don't have time to be like traveling, wasting gas and stuff like that. Um, so yeah, um, and then I got some um, sweet corn on a cob. I cannot wait to have it because I've been wanting some, some corn on cob with some butter, black pepper, and a little sea salt. Yes. Um, so I got some of this fresh corn. Then my boyfriend made a, a little request that I pick up some of this um, a steakhouse uh, original small batch sausage. It says it's pecan smoked. Um, so yeah, I got some of this for him. And this is like a new find in Aldi's. I've never seen this. And so um, I picked that up for him. And if y'all know me, I love my seasonings. And I might buy two of the same seasonings. Now y'all may see uh, that I bought, purchased this in the Target haul. Oh yeah, while we talk about Target, you guys, I did pick up some of these. <laughs> the Febreze plug um, plugins. 
Um, this is in the Fresh Twist of Cranberry. This is for the holidays, baby. And it's a limited edition. So if I was y'all, definitely pick up one or two, maybe three or four. If you are a fragrance sense a holic like me, uh, pick you up multiple, okay? But yeah, let's get back to the Ollie's. But I did buy that at Target um, today as well. But yes, I did pick up some onion powder. I picked up some garlic powder. I picked up some red peppers. And then I picked up some oregano. I love herbs, you guys. I love any herbs. I think I want to start like a mini herb garden. You guys know I am not a green throat green throat a green thumb gardener but i feel like i can do it i feel like i can grow me a little garden somewhere on this counter okay an indoor herb garden like sis <laughs> and then i got some lettuce because i want to make salads and stuff like that i am so tired of going to the stores and i don't know if you guys be like this too but i am so tired of like having to pick through all like the fresh lettuce or the fresh salad kits and I'm so tired of seeing brown leaf lettuce I'm so tired of seeing it rotten like what's going on so I decided just to start buying the big lettuce cutting it down for salads and stuff like that and just having it on hand at home doing it myself and not have to worry about you know have to pick through just any spag of lettuce that is brown <laughs> so I've had been having like trouble like all week trying to find some good quality lettuce um, and so I just decided just let me do my own you know so I got some lettuce from Aldi as well and then I got some happy forms by Aldi's Mexican style blend cheese it has Monterey Jack um, whatever it is <laughs> And yeah, I love, the love, love their cheese. And it's really, really, re really good. And then I also found a new find. And I was watching somebody on YouTube that was talking about the whole blonde roast coffee. And I definitely decided to pick some up at Aldi's because I'm not going to go out and buy any from Starbucks. They're so expensive. So I went and got some at the cheapest place I can find which is Aldi's and I'm sure it tastes just the same um, so I want to go ahead and try this blondie roast light roast these are 12 cups for the Kiri oh you guys let me show you the Kiri my boyfriend bought for me this one like my earlier Christmas gift you guys but this is the single serve Kiri so I just have all my little favorite coffees and stuff over there and I honestly love it because I only do like maybe two cups two cups of coffee one when I leave for work and one when I come home yes so I am really thankful I got rid of the bulky one because it just stopped on me you guys like it just it just played out okay but anyways you guys I am so glad that you stopped by you're watching if you made it this far thank you so 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 much I'm glad that you are here and make sure you thumbs up this video make sure you subscribe if you're not subscribed get subscribed become a subscriber it doesn't cost anything and I appreciate you supporting my channel um, and so yeah I hope you guys enjoy the targets and the all these a grocery haul um, I will be back um, I don't know when I'm gonna be back it's but it, but it's gonna be soon so yeah I don't want to put any like any days out there because you guys know I'm single mom out here in these streets I work full-time so yes when I when I have a haul I'm gonna put it out there and when I have anything else to share with you guys I'm gonna put it out there like I said I'm gonna start being consistent and yes I am happy like to make this video for you guys I am so happy but anyways you guys I'll talk to you later bye